Hello, and welcome back to the second episode of the Crux World series where I go and tour other people's builds. I am starting here specifically for this build over there of this giant person. This has been one that, another one that's been pretty close to my plot that I have been watching slowly build up over time. And I must say, it is it has certainly been quite interesting to see it get all built up. It started out as like just a wireframe, and I wasn't sure where they were going with it, but the process of building it has been very fascinating to me. I've added a bit more details too since the last time I was here. These flowers are new. I say it's a really good build, and like the human part is really well done, like everything looks like how I'd expect a human to look like, with the exception of the rainbow face, but even that too is well done. If just a tiny bit creepy lol. But yeah, this has been one of my favorite, another of my favorite builds to watch come together. Quite like the bird up at the top, the block choices really add something to it. Never thought about using melons like that. So, well done. What the fuck is that? That's interesting. <laughs> See, this has been a really cool build to watch come together. The other few interesting ones, my plot neighbor has decided to build a tree today on top of their candy lane sweet town build. Curious to see where it's gonna go. They've only got four hours left to finish the tree. I am not sure if it is done yet, but it looks interesting. I see that night vision has returned as well, so that this build looks pretty good too. Not quite sure how this is supposed to be colorful, but it is impressive. They do seem to be missing a bit of their pillar though. It's unfortunate. But really well, really good build, I just don't understand how it fits into the colorful theme. This you may have seen in Doc M's video when he was recording all of it. This is a really interesting build. And my dog just came to my room. So yeah, this is interesting. I quite like the colors on it, like, I think it's some kind of robot, and the use of the copper and sandstone for the joints, I think, it looks really good. So I really do quite like this build. Uh, I think these are like mini little biomes around here at the bottom. Yeah, looks interesting. Let's see if there's anything cool over here. This is cool. Oh, hang on a second, I need to let my dog back out of my room. She can't just make up her mind about where she wants to be. I see that I've been flying upwards. This is cool. I'm gonna actually check to make sure I'm recording because I haven't used OBS before. Yep, still recording. Cool. This is kind of a lot going on here in this plot, but I must say it all comes together pretty well. Sal Frederick from Disasters. Good to, to, to expect to see you here, bud. But yeah, looks pretty interesting. I love my, uh, the rainbow in this is really well done, I think. Like it doesn't feel like forced at all. 
having the different colors in there. I can't remember if I showed that one in my previous video, but I feel like this is one of the best dragons on the entire server. This one right here. The one next to it's pretty good too. But I really do quite like this one. The rainbow tail is really well done, I think. Ooh, spooky noises. Don't know if those are going to be picked up in the recording at all. Oh, I love the new iron block from that. That's cool. Yeah, looks interesting. Ooh, what's this over here? I haven't seen this one yet. That came out really well. Certainly captures the colorful theme, that's for sure. Oh, I love the lanterns and the flowers. I haven't thought of that before. That's clever. And over here, there's this build. Eye monster thingy. Whatever that is. Not sure what that is. That's new. Is that like Santa, but like military Santa or something? Not sure. There's a lot of really cool builds over here I haven't seen yet. Oh, it's Sauron! You know, one thing I want to grab. It's Sauron! And a penguin! Multiple penguins! I'm gonna go over here and see this. Yellow Sauron. This is- I love this. This is cute. Like Penguin Arcade, I think. I love this. This is great. Not quite sure what this is, but it looks interesting. Planets, maybe? Not sure. And somebody playing hockey over here. It's a well done statue. I'm just gonna quickly remind everybody that the contest ends in four hours, or under three. What time is it? Contest ends in about three and a bit hours. I have not yet seen who the winner is. So, good luck to everyone. <laughs> Keep the smiles on your face or something, I guess. I can't remember if this one was shown at all. This is... Like, that's... The one over there was a really good dragon, but I think this one was my favorite out of all of them. I just really love how the colors come together on it, and it just feels so mellow. And I can't tell if it's supposed to be like a real dragon or a statue of a dragon because of things like the mushrooms, but I really love how this whole build just, it, it just feels really nice and peaceful, which I really do quite like. So I'm not quite sure what a lot of these are supposed to represent, but they certainly look cool. Like, I have absolutely no idea what that's supposed to be. YouTuber person. I'm sure they have some interesting stuff. Builds for fun. I mean, that does seem to be how building goes. Yeah, fishes. And axolotls. Okay, not quite sure where I was, but uh, I'm back now, so yeah, fishes and axolotls and we think a glow squid it looks fairly interesting. Okay, I really like how the axolotls came out with the rainbows all over them, so quite like this build. 
That's another really good build here on the server. We have another one over here. I didn't see this one. What's this one? What's the sign say? The Axolotl Barracks. What, what does that mean? I'm not sure. It's another sign. Underground Axolotl. So it is. Flying Axolotl too. Flying Underground Axolotl. among us again. Like, guys, the imposter's killing somebody right there. Just press the emergency meeting button. I said this build a while ago. The, it's really good human, I think. And, like, even more impressive, I think, is the rainbow, because this kind of shape is really hard to build with how it bends like that. So, like, the amount of effort on this build alone surely ought to count for something. But it does look really cool and I do quite like it. Little castle scene, I think? Not sure what's going on here. Castle looks nice, though. This is quite a lot going on in this build. Little bird ends. That's adorable, I like the bird. Little piratey boat thingy. And a house and a snow globe. And an upside down city. I'm not quite sure how this build all ties together, but all of it does look cool. Getting some Marvel Asgard vibes from this build. Doesn't quite look finished though, I don't think, unless those blocks back there aren't for, like, aren't like blocks just for like outlines and stuff. I forgot what they're called. Throne. This might, might actually be Asgard, I'm not sure. Let's go see if I can find a sign. How do I get out of here? There we go. Ooh! Getting distracted. That's a nice looking mushroom. Let's see what's inside. Lots of tiny little mushrooms. We don't have anything on this big mushroom though. Go up the ladder. Little aquarium. That's nice. Nice detail. A clock. Ooh. I was wondering how to build a clock in my build earlier. I guess I could have done something like this. Because item frames are disabled, I wasn't able to have a clock item. Nice little window. Anything else in here? I don't think so. These blocks. The, the beehives are some of my favorite blocks for making floors. What else do we have? We got whatever's going on over here. Uh, Kraken and a boat, I think it's supposed to be. Looks interesting, that's for sure. Okay. I love, I, I like the idea of using the sea lanterns as both lighting and also the suction cups. Oh, this is nice. How did you get a boat? I don't understand how you got a boat. But the houses do look really nice. And other boat. This boat looks cool. I like this. I feel like we can go sailing off into the mushroom hut over there. Interesting over there. These also have interiors. They do, but I can't go in them. Never stop learning because life never stops teaching. You know that that is true. Do all of them have something? No. That one does. As long as there is coffee in the world, how bad could things be? Well, I don't like coffee, so I'm not sure what the answer to that is. 
I can't quite read this one. Let me try though. I, I honestly don't know that there's a bush in the way. Over here? Never takes. <laughs> I don't believe he said that, but like, that is good advice. Not quite sure what this is supposed to represent, but this is a cool use of those blocks to texture the sword. Also not quite sure what's going on here, but it certainly looks interesting. I get this is like another fortress, I guess. Maybe nethery stuff? But I'm not sure what the rest of it's supposed to represent. More among us. And a creeper there. Oh, what's this? Rainbow. Oh, this is cool. I like this build. I, I love the cat, that's interesting. This is not a build I was expecting to see on the server, but it looks, it, it's really well done, I think. I can imagine the shirt's a reference to something, but I don't know what. Rainbow graffiti. Nirvana. Hey, okay. Not quite sure what builds I've shown in the last episode and which ones I haven't, but I don't think I've been this way. No, I haven't seen this before though. This is cool. Another cherry tree. I I love the person in the kimono. I think that's how it's pronounced. Nice looking umbrella. Like this build looks cool, so yeah. Very there's a, quite a wide selection of builds uh, in the entire server. I quite like the amount of variety there is. It's a little submarine. Can I go inside the submarine? I can go inside the submarine. This doesn't seem like a very watertight submarine, but it certainly looks cool. I love the Use of that for the anchor, I haven't thought of that before. Oh, the tropical fish. Good looking build, even if there's not a whole lot in the rest of the plot. The spots that are finished look really good. Anything down here in the cave? Eh, a little bit. Some amethyst. Looks interesting, I wonder if the creator is planning anything else with it. More Among Us. Oh, this is nice up here. I like this. The tree. This is cute, I like it. Oh, there's a mineshaft thing. Does it go anywhere? Caution, collapsed mineshaft ahead. Danger or collapsed mine shaft. Yeah, that doesn't look terribly great. If there's anyone in there, I hope they're alright. It's a bee. It's a really good looking bee too. I like that. More Among Us with with Crocs. It's Among Us with Crocs. Ooh, this is nice. I love the clock. Can I go in it? There's signs, let's see what the signs say. Do you like the sound? Um, I don't know. I don't hear the sound. It might show up in the recording, I'm not sure, but I don't hear any of it. The belt looks cool though. quite like that. If anyone can tell me who this person is, I'd very much like to know. It's like, a lot of people seem to be building that person. 
see what else we can find. My life, I think? This is an interesting interpretation of the prompt, that's for sure. I love uh, the, like, mini biomes and all of the checkered areas. Ooh, we can go down. I don't know if it's intentional or not, but we can go down. Snowy mountains. Snowy indeed. Yeah, I don't think I was supposed to go down that way. Beach and ocean. Flesh caves or dripstone caves. The end, spooky. Can we go to the end? No. Surprise! No surprises. Certainly an interesting build, that's for sure. Let's see what else we can find. It's another smiley face. Hey, we're back at the little mushroom house over there. I should go this way then. This looks good. It's a lot of various blocks for texturing. The tree looks nice. I never thought to use the raw copper blocks in a tree before, but it, I must say it turns out really nice. Little volcano. I'm going to assume this is a mix of two people, I think? It's Nine Cat! Woo! Nine Cat and a bird! I feel like this bird is another reference to something. Let's see if the signs say anything. Uh, no, just who it was built by. Oh, this looks nice. I feel like we need to take a walk here on the ground in this build. It's Alfredric again! Hello, Alfredric. I love the bees, though. And the spooky noises. Like one here. No. How did you do that? Oh wait, no, that's just my texture pack. Why can't I open the door? Oh, there, there is glow lichen on it. Okay, that's what I thought. Ah, oh, Frederick, you've you've multiplied yourself. No. But it looks cool. Oh, Rainbow River. I like that. That looks nice. A house on top of a QR code. I wonder where that goes, but I'm not gonna scan it. Not sure what these are, but it looks cool. Another portal and weird plant things that look like they, they're gonna eat me. Little waterfall. Oh, looks interesting. It's a unicorn! Hello, unicorn. I gotta go check this one out. It's two unicorns! Ah, I love this build. This build is great. I quite like this one. How are we doing with the recording time? 25 minutes in. I guess I... Well, I guess I'll call it here. So, thanks for watching everybody. There's gonna be one more of these coming out tomorrow. So, see you then. Bye!